Yellow. Science is not an authority. Truth is the authority. Science at its purest is an excavator of truth, but the reality is most published research is wrong. It is false. Most published research is false. And another reality, most of what we've contrived today was done so out of serendipity. We did so serendipitously. Us stumbling through chaos, stumbling our way through a universe that perpetuated pain and suffering. Through this process, we somehow stumbled in the darkness and serendipitously found a way to mitigate a bit of that. A bit of that suffering and the accumulation of that mitigation is the world we have today. Not the umbrella of science, the umbrella of serendipity. Now, what happens when you have this umbrella as the authority? Okay, again, it is not the authority. Truth is the authority. And if you excavate truth, it fights for itself. The truth fights for itself. That is the scientific method. When you excavate something that is congruent, a pattern of this reality that holds consistently true, when you attack it, it stands for itself. It stands for itself. You attack it, it doesn't back down. The truth is indestructible. What happens though when you have science as the authority? Someone else can come along under this umbrella. They did not excavate the truth. Instead, they're saying, I'm part of this group. Let me speak for you. And what often happens? even though most published research is wrong, to further add insult to injury, to further damage the reputation of something that was supposed to be pure. You can have individuals corrupt this infrastructure, this tool, science is a tool, you can have it corrupted by having financial interest invested. And this person, perhaps they have student debt, they'll say whatever to get out of the suffering they're in, they'll say, okay, Okay, I'm supposed to be pure, but I can't be. I'm going to play with the politics simply because I need to get out of the student debt. And boom, with a little bit of investment, this entity over here that invested the money makes more money. And that's what we have today. A lot of published research is wrong. Most published research is wrong. And we're fueling it, we're funding it, often because it makes money. Running with it will make more money. But that doesn't change a thing because ultimately we're seeing it today. People are gaining a distrust for science. They're distrusting science as they should. It is being corrupted because you're turning it into an authority. It is not an authority. That is foolish. Truth is the authority and it stands for itself. And anyone, regardless of who they are, if they speak the truth, it will fight for itself regardless of who they are, even you, regardless of if you're a scientist, if you speak what you know is true, it will fight for itself. It will stand firm regardless of the attacks. It will not cave under pressure. It will not back down. The truth stands resolute. It stands firm regardless of who attacks it. Thus, as an excavator of truth with this message, I hope science can refine its purity. Lose the ego. Lose the politics. Instead, be what you're always intended to be. A tool which at its purest, at its finest, is supposed to excavate truth. Truth being the authority.